I recognize your fragrance. Hold up, you ain't never gotta say. What's up, everybody? Welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Diamond, and in today's video, I'm gonna be straightening my hair. It's been a minute since I straightened my hair. I don't even remember how long it's been, honestly. But I just dyed my hair. I dyed the top black, and I dyed it underneath like a light caramel brown. Yeah, I'm gonna straighten it though. So we're gonna see, like what it's hitting for when it's straight at first i'm going to use some heat protector though because your girl is not trying to get no damage for no straight hair period okay so these are the heat protectors that i have just this heat protector the blow dry and flatter type um heat protector and then i have a serum that i'll put on when i am about to straighten my hair because when you put oils in your hair when you're about to blow dry it takes forever for it to dry so i like to just blow dry my hair with just like this spray okay this is the blow dryer I'm using. I always love a blow dryer with an attachment so I can get a smooth blow dryer. So yeah, I'm gonna work from the back up and I'm gonna time lapse it because I don't wanna bore you with the blow dryer. Now that we're all done blow drying, I like to get as smooth as possible with my blow dry so it's easier for me to flat iron. I'm using my Babyliss Pro flat irons. These are amazing, but be careful with the heat. I'm using mine on 350 degrees. I'm taking my serum and I'm just gonna place that all throughout my hair, emphasis on the ends. Don't use too much because it'll cause it to be weighed down. I'm sectioning my hair off, deal with the top later. I'm using this Frizz Buster Serum. And then I'm just going to section my hair off into really small sections. I ended up making that into two sections instead of one. I'm going to do like a couple taps on my roots and then bring it on through with one pass. One pass throughout my entire head. The smaller the section that you take, the sleeker the look will come out. We're already using a lower heat to protect our hair, so the silk press will be silky, baby, if you use really small sections. And it looks like I'm going fast, but this is sped up. I'm actually going extremely slow. And that's because I'm only using one pass, but I will double tap or triple tap over my roots to get them really sleek because if they're not sleek then your look will be puffy and it'll look like maybe it's like a week old or like maybe a couple days old and we don't want that we want it to look fresh and silky Okay, y'all, that took a long time, and it's because I was using doing those small sections, but it looks really good. I like it, I guess. I don't know. It's giving me very much. I don't know. I feel like I just have to get used to it. But here's how it looks. I have these flyaways up here. I'm going to wrap my hair because I have to take a shower. But um, if I wasn't, then I would take this oil and um, it would get the flyaways. But when I unwrap my hair, I'm going to do that. But if you can see, it's like heck of flyaways up there. But it's fine. I'm talking about it is staticky in here, child. What in the world? Mm -mm. But yeah, so here it is. She's longer than I expected. It's like, I didn't even know my hair could grow this long. Um, let me show y'all the back. So like, let me take the wind gloves. That's just what it looks like. Um, I don't know how I'm gonna let the color show though. I feel like I'm gonna curl it a little bit, so. So it can be like, 
color showing so like i'm just whip it right here and then have like this out you know so yeah okay Ooh. i am so sorry if my camera's been turning my phone's in a charger so it's being very extra let me know how y'all feel about it let me know how y'all feel about the color let me know if you think i'm tripping or let me know if you think i need to give it the program and you know like my hair um yeah this is how it looks um i'm gonna put it in a ponytail so y'all can see how it looks so if i get like a down look this is how it would look kind of cute um and then a full ponytail this is how it would look i like it i don't i don't mind it at all um so yeah um, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Make sure y'all comment down below. Let me know what you're filming. Um, and yeah, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Look at, I, I dyed my hair. That's why that is like that if you were wondering. But yeah, I love you guys and I will see you in my next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.